Hi there! I'm so excited that you're thinking about transferring to the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign. The key to transferring to the U of I is planning, since there are a lot of steps to take. Today, I'm going to walk you through all of them. Let's get started! At the U of I, you'll apply directly into a major. If you know the major you want, great! Then you can check out our website to see if and when it accepts transfer applicants. If you're not sure what you'd like to major in, that's okay too. Just start by exploring all of our options and then you can narrow it down from there. When it comes to learning our admissions requirements, our transfer handbook is an amazing resource. It shows you pretty much everything you need to know about our requirements all in one place, including the courses you'll need to take before transferring based on your intended major. Also, if you've been attending a college in the state of Illinois, you'll want to check out the U of I's Transfer Guide. This tool is especially great because it lets you select your current college from a list so you can confirm you're taking the right classes. It's not only helpful to know our course requirements, but also how courses you've already taken will transfer to the U of I. To learn which course credits may come along with you to our university, check out the website Transferology. Transferology is a nationwide database. By creating a free account, you can see all the courses we've ever reviewed for transfer from your college. Helpful, right? Now that you're done with your prep work, it's time to actually apply. The U of I offers two application periods for transfer applicants, one for spring admission and one for fall. You can learn the dates for each on our website. Our application is pretty straightforward, but here are just a few tips from me to you. Again, know the major you're going to apply to, be prepared to write one to two essays, and provide a list of your recent activities and accomplishments. And finally, know that you'll need to pay an application fee, or have a school official from your current college submit a fee waiver on your behalf. At this point, you're almost done! All that's left is to provide your supporting materials. These are things like official transcripts and any test scores. You'll also want to see if there are any special requirements for your major, like an audition or a portfolio review. Make sure to regularly check your application status. This is to ensure that we aren't missing anything or haven't requested anything more from you. You've worked hard to get to this point. You deserve to cross that finish line. And speaking of the finish line, we've made it to the end of our checklist. I hope this helps you throughout our transfer process, and I hope to see you on campus sometime soon. Good luck. You've got this.